Hey, how's it going everyone? Joey Kissimmee here with IncomePress.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can use uh, the Ninja Affiliate Links plugin uh, to your advantage and to give you a little bit of an unfair advantage over the rest of your competition. Okay, now this is a premium plugin and it's basically a plugin that allows you to shorten your URLs and make them look pretty and sexy and all that stuff and easily to tell people where to go right because if, if you do any type of affiliate marketing or whatever and you have a referral link usually those referral links are long or sh if they're short they're all ugly and got weird characters so this plugin allows you to really just make those links look pretty and easily easily recognizable and easily to to listen to and remember okay because you don't want to tell people hey go to a whole bunch of characters link 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 and then they're gonna forget okay and so I'm gonna show you the different ways that I use it and how you can use it to give you a little bit of an unfair advantage over the rest of your competition because the rest of the competition don't know about this so if they're doing podcasts they're doing videos or whatever they're not gonna know what to do here uh, they're not gonna know what to tell people to go they're just gonna try to tell them hey go to my my page here find this and then click on that you know that's too many steps you just want to tell people hey go here and that's it so let me just show you a few examples of how i use it and then i'm gonna show you how how you can use it for yourself okay so i got one right here i got a whole bunch of stuff here as you can see i got i mean i got tons of links here and i use it for all types of stuff so this is one of my affiliate links the how pr40 i, I uh, talk about this on my blog here on the incompressed.com so let's just go show you real quick and click on this edit to show you how it looks like in the back part on the back end now I named the link or that link name to let me know what that link is about okay to find it easily because I got you know like I said I got tons of them so this helps me find it easily and then right down here affiliate link destination well that's my actual affiliate link so you can see here's weird characters can you imagine just telling people hey go to amzn.com to slash whatever it's just too hard to remember so if i'm in here in you know this video or in a podcast or whatever or if i just tell people in a networking conference or whatever if i just talking to someone and tell them hey go to incompress.com slash heil pr 40 they're going to know what that is they're going to remember it right away and as soon as they go to their uh their browser they're going to type it in okay especially if we've been talking about that they're going to know it's really easy to remember it sticks right there and you can just go and type it in all right and then right here some more stuff to help me organize and i'll show you exactly how to do that okay uh, another way i like to use it is with my post my actual post you know the posts have long links they have keywords you know stuff there you know like for example uh, my podcast episodes right let me show you this one here we go in there real quick for my podcast episodes i always tell people hey for the show notes and everything we talked about today go to incompress.com slash episode 20 and you'll get everything there you see how easily that is so if you're driving to work or coming from work or running or doing exercising and you're listening to me i just tell you hey for all the stuff we talked about today go to episode 20 you're going to remember that now imagine if i'm in you're listening to my podcast episode and i just tell you hey go to you know incompress.com slash expert dash ronda dash podcast dash i mean you're not gonna, <laughs> you're not going to remember that okay so this little cool thing here allows you to you know just go ahead and shorten up urls make them look pretty and you know um, again right down here you know if you're split testing got multiple products that you're promoting you know i got the studio press themes i uh, talk about that on many um, of my posts here and articles here on income press and you know i just separate each one lifestyle magazine generate themes did the streamline theme so it, it gives me a list of clicks and who's clicking them and all that stuff right um, let me just show you how to track them. This is a great way to track your links and making sure that it's something that's working for you. Okay, one of my most popular ones is this iVipit one. I talk about how to create a Fox logo and all that stuff, all right? Let me just show you real quick here. Where's the one? The referrals right here. So right here, it lets me know where where's the hottest clicks at. Where are people really clicking this at right here? And you can see the most popular post I got right there, uh, which is make a Universal Studios and Fox logo. I talk about how to do that. I get for over close to 1,500 clicks on that post alone. 
And then another one's on the videos right on YouTube. You know, I got 686 on that one, 383 on that one. So you see where, you know, I could right here see where my highest clicks are at. So, you know, obviously I would leave those alone because I'm getting a lot of clicks. But then down here, I could actually see where these are at. I could go to these different videos, see where else am I getting clicks at. You know, if it's other pages that other people are linking back to me, you know, whatever. I'll just go back over there and see what what's going on. But, you know, you, you get the idea, right? So you can actually track your, your clicks, where they're clicking from. Go to that post, optimize it some more. Maybe on this one, there's some something else that I want to promote on that particular thing. Uh, uh, since that's the highest traffic, the highest click through rates, I could go there and put some other products or something or maybe some ads. I don't know. But we'll talk about that in another video when I talk about advertising. But uh, there you have it. You know, you, you could use this plugin for a lot of stuff. So split testing to make your, your stuff pretty and your post and, and all that stuff. So let's go ahead and show you exactly how to use this plugin. Let's go back to my DIY niche site. And I'm going to go to the, 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 the my WordPress uh, dashboard. And then right here on the left-hand side, I'm just going to scroll down here where it says tools. Okay, just hover over it. And you're going to see right here something, a list of stuff pop up. Just go to MVP Ninja Affiliate. So just go ahead and click on that. Okay, it'll take you right here. And as you can see, I just got a few. The block's fairly new, right? But I'm still getting a little bit of clicks here, right? Some affiliate products and all that stuff. So let me just go ahead and show you how to do this. Okay, so let's go ahead and click here and click on add new. Okay, so you're gonna get this little thing. You're gonna call the link whatever. Let's just say this is a link that, um, you know, telling people about in a podcast. I'm actually going to start a podcast show for this particular um, for this particular niche here. So I could probably say episode. Oh my god, I can't believe episode. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and use that one. Episode one. Okay. And then right here could be a really long, long link. So let's just go ahead and go to the actual blog post here. Okay. And go ahead and uh just go ahead and choose this one here. Let's just say this one. Yeah, I don't have any, you know, podcast episodes, but let's just say here. Okay, let me scroll this down here. As you can see, there's uh, I mean, that thing is just really long, you know. So I just want to tell people, hey, go to you know, simpleweekendprojects.com/episode21. So right there, I would put the link there. Right down here, I would put episode one. Okay, that's it. And then right here. You could actually put categories and this helps me to organize this a little bit better okay so what i would do here is uh you know i don't have a podcast episode but if it's an affiliate link i put it on affiliates if it's an amazon affiliate link i put it on the amazon and since this is a podcast episode let's just go ahead and put it here podcast show okay so once i'm done there that's pretty much it i don't do anything here about cloaking it or convert keywords i don't do any of that stuff this is all i do here with this I click on add link and there you have it that's it right there I got episode one so all I would do is just go ahead and uh, open it or not open I would left or right click it sorry and then I would go around here copy link location and then I would put it in that particular episode or post or whatever or I would just tell people hey go to simpleweekendprojects.com slash episode one and you can see right up here at the top and it just looks all nice and pretty okay so that's pretty much how to use this really nothing to it it's not rocket science you know like i always say this is not rocket science it's internet science and internet science is really simple if you let it be you could actually be difficult but only if you let it but that's pretty much it that's how you use the ninja affiliate links a plugin this is a premium plugin so um if you want to get it through my affiliate link, I will get a commission if you purchase it through that link. And I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much. And I would love you to death if you do so. If not, no biggie. No biggie whatsoever. No problems. I mean, I do these videos for you to teach you some good stuff. And if you already have the plugin and you didn't know how to do some, you know, pretty cool stuff here, then, and then there you have it, you know. Um, but if you have any questions whatsoever, guys, any questions whatsoever, how to do something, if it's not working for you, whatever, let me know. Post your questions in the comments below. I will answer them personally. Okay. I personally answer every 
question or every comment. I don't have like an assistant or whatever that does that for me. This plugin and pretty much every single plugin that I uh, promote or I recommend, I personally use and I know like the back of my hand. I would not tell you to get this if I didn't believe in it. This plugin has I've used it for years. I use it for everything, all of my niche sites, all of my blogs. And then for my private clients, it just makes things life a lot easier. So, you know, and if, you, if you've found this video useful, just go ahead and, and like it. If you're on YouTube watching this video, go ahead and subscribe. I always post videos like this and great info, great content and great tutorials for you guys to learn from. Okay. So with that said, this is Joey Kissimmee. Peace. I love you for free and I'll see you on the next.